Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel IT Planet. If this video is helpful to you, then don't forget to hit like button and subscribe to channel IT Planet. Here on this channel, you will get the exercise solutions of your all the chapters of your computer book. And here in this video, we are going to see the exercise solution of class 7, chapter number 5, that is Photoshop working with layers. Let's see first question. Tick the correct answers. Number one, when we open an image in Photoshop, it appears as a background layer in layers palette. The answer is background. We can hide a layer temporarily, remove elements in that layer from view. Number three, opacity is the opposite of transparency. Number four, transforming a layer allows we to keep the rest of our image unchanged. And number five, BMP is a popular Windows image format. So these are the answers of tick the correct answer. Number B, write T for true and F for false statement. Let's see, number one statement, layered Photoshop files act like several images combined into one. This is true statement. Number two, we cannot combine, duplicate and hide layers in Photoshop. This is false statement because we can do all these functions, right? We can do all these tasks. Number three, we can delete a layer when we no longer need it. This is true. Number four statement, merging layer stretches and squeezes area of our image. This is false statement. Photoshop image editor has one blending mode. This is false statement because Photoshop image editor has not only one blending mode, there are so many blending modes. That's why this statement is false. Let's see the fill in the blanks. Number one, layers are the key components to work with graphic objects in Photoshop. The answer is layers. Number two, flatten layers. Combine all the layers of an image into one background layer. Number three, by decreasing the opacity of a layer, its transparency increases. Number four, blending modes specify how pixels in a layer should blend with the layers. And number five, PICT is a popular Macintosh image format. So these are the answers of fill in the blanks. Let's move further. Question number D, that is differentiate between the following. We have to write the difference between merge layers and flatten layers. So merge layers option lets us permanently combine information from two separate layers. And flatten layers, flattening layers combine all the layers of an image into one background layer. It will create only one background layer. So this is the difference between merge layers and flatten layers. Let's see next question number E. Answer in one to two sentences. Question number one. What are layers in Photoshop? In Photoshop, layers are the key components to work with graphic objects. These are used to work on individual parts of an image without affecting the other parts. And the number two. What is the use of renaming a layer the answer is renaming a layer helps us in identifying it in a better way or managing many layers in a single image question number three that is what is the use of hiding a layer answer is hiding a layer temporarily removes elements in that layer from the view and the question number four that is, what do you mean by transforming a layer? Then the answer is, transform tool is used to change the shape of the objects in the layer and it allows us to keep the rest of our image unchanged. So these are the answers of answering one to two sentences. Now answer briefly in that question number one. What are layers? Name the various tasks that you can do with them and 
and the answer will be layers are the key components to work with graphic objects these are used to work on individual parts of an image without affecting the other parts we can do these tasks using layers hiding layer moving layer duplicating layer deleting layer recording layer changing layer opacity flattening layer merge layers and transform layers so this will be the answer of first question second question is what do you mean by blending modes of layer layers ke blending modes kaun se and the answer will be photoshop blending modes specify how pixels in a layer should blend with the layers below photoshop has many blending modes selecting a blending mode changes the appearance of the layer or image based on the layer or layers beneath it so this will be the answer of second question the last question that is application based question rahul's teacher asked him to create an image of flowers in different layers and then combine all the layers of the image into one background layer rahul is unable to do to do so tell him the option yes the answer will be rahul should use flatten layer or merge layer option to combine all the layers according to his need so this is the exercise solution of class 7 chapter number 5 and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you for watching this video and bye bye take care